Hey YouTube, how's it going? I got this uh, issue with a BMW 328i, uh, 1997 E36 motor. Uh, what was happening was essentially it would not hold an idle. You would start it up and you'd have to get the revs up to get the car to stay on. And then the idle would just drop and go to zero. Uh, it should happen every single time starting it up so you kind of have the two foot to even drive it. Keep the RPMs up above a thousand. Uh, threw a bunch of trouble codes, I'll list those in the description. But uh, what it ultimately ended up alluding to was the uh, intake uh, air control valve or the intake speed valve. Um, these things are notorious for uh, getting dirty and failing. So ripped apart the uh, air box and the intake elbow. And lo and behold, all it was, was on this intake elbow on the bottom of it, you can see right here, there's that little tube that uh, nozzle hooks to a tube that leads to the intake uh, control valve. It was this one here had fallen off. And all we had to do was put it back on, clamp it up, and it would run and stay above, you know, the idle RPM to, to, to stay on. Uh, computer codes are still on, um, but I think we just have to reset the computer for that because it was tripping everything else, uh, oxygen sensors and whatnot. But essentially, one thing I wanted to show you was that they had the uh, bunch of videos showing you how to clean your uh, intake control valve. And it's kind of hard to see here, uh, but you can actually access this um, without having to take the whole intake apart. It's a little hard to see, but it's actually right in here. Bottom of the nozzle is right down in here. It's really hard to see. But it's down there, it's just kind of like a downward pointing uh, aluminum cylinder. Um, if you reach your hand up there, you can feel it's where that, that hose ultimately connects to. So you'll be able to find out where that, where that is if you kind of wrestle off the, uh, the hose clamp and get that hose off if that's giving you a problem. But you can clean this out with some carb cleaner and a, and a uh, uh, Q-tip if you don't want to rip apart the throttle body and all that stuff just to see if that kind of helps your idle problems. Um, so you can kind of like get the carb cleaner. I have one of those reverse uh, hoses here for the carb cleaner and you just hold it sideways and it'll spray up and then get yourself some uh, some uh, Q-tips and uh, go ahead and go to town and get it clean. See if that improves your idle.